Well, a wonderful event where we were able to dedicate the collection here in the Virginia Room in the memory and honor of uh, George Kegley, who was a longtime historian of the Roanoke Valley, volunteer for many historical societies, so, so appropriate that we could honor his memory in this way in a room in which I'm sure he spent much time and for all of his contributions to all of us that are involved in documenting and celebrating and preserving local history. So we worked recently with the Historical Society of Western Virginia collaboratively to digitize their, uh, their journal and George was the editor of that for 40 years. So we now have the full run of that that journal and so that's part of what we wanted to do here in the library to honor George's memory. Uh, so it's invaluable information for historians and for local uh, authors uh, to access here in the Virginia Room and online as well. Oh it's so so nice, it's so meaningful. Um, Dad loved this place, he loved the director Sheila Umbarger and um, spent hours here. I remember growing up uh, not coming here, but the, the amount of time he would spend around the historical uh, details that he loved. And um, history was the one thing that we all sort of grew up with, um, with the same passion that he had. But you can't match him. You can't match George Kegley's history passion, but yeah. Well, the Virginia Room is really the repository for historic and genealogical information pertaining to southwestern Virginia. And so uh, it uh, obviously has uh, family histories, it has uh, the newspapers on microfilm, it has a uh, book collection on uh, county and regional uh, history. So really, the Virginia Room is the go-to place for folks that are looking to trace their family tree or to learn about the history of the Roanoke Valley or to do research that might serve for various purposes for articles or journals or historic preservation. One of the things that I would say the most important thing I believe that we're actually doing here is preserving local stories and history. So I know on the Virginia Room, my dad uh, would come down here in person, spend a lot of time down here, not online. You know, he would come down here and look at one thing and find several other things to that would just pull him in. He loved it here, so um, it was a great resource. I had the privilege to know George for, for many, many years, probably for about 30 years. George was so helpful in helping me uh, write some of the books that I did. I always sent chapters to him to edit and to proof, both for uh, uh, factual uh, corrections as well as for grammatical corrections, and he was wonderful at both. Just a very dedicated man who, really all of us could, could uh, if we just did half of what he did, the community would be even greater than it already is. He was humble. He was humble. He uh, sort of rejected having his name up there, but he would, of course he would. He valued this place tremendously, so yeah, I know he would. 